Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and I'm about to serve you some realness right now. Can I just first start off by saying welcome back to my channel and then also I want to tell you to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, comment in the comment section below, follow my social medias, they'll be down in the description and on the screen somewhere too. So today's video is going to be my daily routine, okay? So when I wake up in the morning, what I do every single time. This is my skincare a regime that I kind of stick to now that's been working really, really well with me with my acne and my ex acne and my scarring all mixed in one. So I'm just gonna show you what my face looks like now. So my skin's not perfect right now and I definitely know I've got spots. And the reason why I've got so many spots is because this is my fault, is the sugar. We've spoken about this before. I eat a lot of sugar, I need to stop, and I think that's the main issue with my skin. But it is also time of the month, and I normally film time of the month, it always falls on time of the month, and I'm gonna have a few outbreaks. But anyway, so what I like to do is make sure my face is nice and clean. I normally wash it with um, Dr. Bronner's soap, I'll put it on the screen here. And then once a week I like to use my Nip and Fab glycolic scrub if you haven't seen my nip and fab haul go check it out because you can see what i use from the nip and fab range i like to do this once a week or if i am wearing makeup i do it about two three times a week so the next step is toner and i like to use the brand sunita cosmetics i have done a review on her products i'm obsessed so what i like to do i like to do a two to one ratio of the natural spot treatment and the orange blossom and aloe vera toner and i like to put it in a spray bottle so i put it in my side a skin spray bottle and i spray all over my face let's do that that's already mixed in there so two parts orange blossom and aloe vera one part the spot treatment just to keep those nasties at bay and if i'm having a really bad breakout i will add more of the spot treatment so oh my god it feels so nice and boiling and then what I like to do is I just like to let it sink in. Okay, so once the skin has completely dried, what I like to go in is with my other favorite skincare brand is Baselift. You know I use a lot of Baselift. So Baselift is a derma rolling brand, but with the derma rolling brand, they do face masks and they do amazing serums. I cannot live without this brightening serum. It includes vitamin C and hyaluronic acid. It really does hydrate the skin. And I had a few sussy comments on some of my videos saying, oh my God, I don't know whether to believe people when they make these videos, because if they have a promo code, that means they don't use it. And that's not how promo codes work. For me in particular, it's been, um, I use one full pipette by the way and um, what happened to me is I review the product on my YouTube channel after a month or so and then I message them and say hi I'd like you to check out my video I reviewed your product if there is any possibility do you have a discount code that I can use for myself and my followers and then most of the time they reply yes sometimes they say no and you're like okay cool maybe I'm not famous enough yet and that's the end of it so that's what happened with me and basically I reviewed their products first genuine reviews i do not lie on my channel i made my youtube channel to kind of counteract what was going on this whole system of people going oh yeah i love this product it's so nice and they've never used it oh i love this product and they've used it once you know and they've not really reviewed it properly just because they're going to get money from it because when i started looking on youtube for certain things i can never find the right review for me or i try a product and it doesn't work and i just want to be totally honest with you I always say in my videos, this works for me. If it doesn't work for you, maybe try a different product. Please don't bash people, don't go up to people's YouTube, their Instagrams, especially not mine, and say, oh, you're not telling the truth. Does this product really work? Oh, I tried it and it didn't work for me. And that's the reality. Everyone's body, everyone's skin is different. Not everything's gonna work for you. I'm just trying to be honest and review products that work for me, hoping it'll help someone out there. And also, it's almost like a video log for me and a video diary for me to see what has worked for me in the past, what has not worked, and it helps me understand my skin. Um, so once you put the serum in and once that's soaked up a little bit, what I like to do is I go in with three moisturizers. Yes, three moisturizers. You know I am a moisturizer combiner. You've known that if you've followed me for a while. But all I wanna say is that now it's coming into summer, what I will do now is add a little bit of sun cream to my creams now. These three creams are 
from Sunita Cosmetics, okay? So what I like to do is I like to dot my face with the Palmarosa Gel Moisturizer under Frankincense and Myrrh Sleep Mask. And even though it's a sleep mask, I like to wear it in the daytime and the nighttime because I find it like amazing. And then I like to go in last but not least with this bad boy. This bad boy saved my life. I love turmeric. It does wonders for the skin especially mine it's healed up my acne scars and healed up my spots along with my serums so we're going to start off with the palma rosa and it's like a gel so it's really hydrating and it's not greasy that's what i like about them the turmeric cream looks very oily but and very shiny but it doesn't feel sticky at all then with the turmeric i like to take maybe like that much at night i use like even more it will just melt in your hand and then i like to mix them all together and then i like to go in oh my gosh it's like a drink for my skin aloe vera eye gel again sunita cosmetics so i just like to put in like on the ring finger remember because your eye area is very sensitive last but not least my lip routine okay i like to use the o'keefe's lip repair this is amazing. I wish I found this when I was on Accutane. It is so moisturizing. And then I like to use the Intensive Moisturizer um, by Blistex. I used this when I was on Accutane and it really saved my lips. Your lips will not rip if you use these two. So if you're on Accutane, definitely buy these. I bought these from Boots and the this one was near, about three, four pound nearly, but it's so worth it. Honestly, it's so hydrating. And then if it's really crusty, I go in with the Blistex. But I think I'm nice and moisturized now, so I'm not gonna put the Blistex on one. So that's all I do for my skincare routine in the morning. It really does help. Even with my makeup, my makeup is going on so much better. It's not crusty, because um, when you do roll, your skin gets kind of dry and flaky. But it really, really doesn't matter when you use all these products. Okay guys, if you would like to see my night routine, how I get my skin ready before I go to sleep, let me know in the comment section below, and I will do one of those videos. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. Again, everything I've talked about will be in the description box below. And also, look out for my new videos every single Sunday, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.